greetings and welcome to a new video so today's video is on troll speed you can install troll speed and use it without a jailbreak and you have to use troll store to install troll speed so it will work on all devices and ios version as long as troll store is installed on your device troll speed is completely free and we are at its official github page as you can see it right here it shows upload and download network speed right beneath or below your status bar and if you scroll down you can see the description for troll speed right here also the important thing is you will have to enable developer mode if you are on ios 16 or above to make it work correctly enabling developer mode is very very easy you will head to settings then you will head to privacy and security and scroll down and you will find developer mode and then simply turn it on if you can't find developer mode here you will have to install any ipa using side loadly and then the developer mode will appear here and then you can turn it on you can get the troll store ipa or tipa in the releases section and you can get it from here and install it with troll store i will show you how and we will see how to use it one more thing if you are jailbroken you can install troll store or you can use the provided dot dev files as well to use troll speed with a jailbreak all right guys so we are on device so as i said first of all install troll store the troll store installation guides are in the description then open safari and type here troll speed so that you will get the first link for the official github page for troll speed open it and then simply scroll down and go to releases scroll down and get the tipa file from here and install it download and once complete go back home open troll store hit this plus button install ipa file and then select the tipa file and install it all right once installed you are good to go now open troll speed and then simply hit open hud and you will find your network speed right here below the status bar you can change the position or location of it so if you hit the left arrow it will be displayed right here in the middle and in the right in settings you can change the units or you can change the arrows as you can see it right here so i like these arrows you can change the size as well or you can set it to incoming only and you have various settings so once everything is set you can simply close out of the app and the display will persist now you can open any other app you can even quit out of it and it will keep working as you can see it right here it is working just fine also if you want to exit it you can simply hit exit hud close the app and you are done that's all for this video if you still have questions ask in the comment section and i will reply you as soon as possible i will see you in a new video goodbye and take care